Alright, this is the boat we're going down to the Oslo, May 2022. Going down the river, two hour tour today. This is a boat right there. The picnic tables. You're right. The fortress was rebuilt by King Christian IV of Denmark and Norway. He turned Akershus into a Renaissance castle, and he gave it the appearance it still has today. The outdoor areas of the fortress are open to the public free of charge, and you can also find the Museum of Armed Forces, as well as the Norwegian Resistance Museum here. in line with the tide and wind, offering changing experiences through reflections from the water and its transparent surfaces. likely to catch fish like shrimp, sprat, cod and mackerel. Some of them still follow the tradition of fishing at night and then going into the pier in front of the city hall in the morning to sell their catch fresh directly from their boats. In the 1920s, when alcohol was strictly forbidden in Norway, the bathing houses at Nesodden were used extensively by smugglers. Being accessible by boat but not visible from Oslo, the houses were the perfect location for the illegal sale of alcohol. size. On the outer island there is a sanctuary for rare seabirds which come here for nesting. On the inner island closest to the boat you can see several houses. Despite the fact that there are no public piers or means of public transportation there are several families who live here all year even during winter. Other families only have their summer houses here. rather shallow and there's both grass and sand areas to sunbathe. There's even a diving platform on the western side of the beach and a beach volleyball court. 